Hey folks, David Waldorf here with an unboxing video of Adventureland from Haba. Um, this is an already opened box. This review copy came to me already open, so what you see inside here isn't exactly how you're going to see it when it gets to you. But um, this is what you get inside this box. You have a rules book, um, multilingual, so flips one side uh, over the other like that. Here is the game board opened for you. Alright, and there's some glare, my apologies, but that is what that looks like. Uh, nice artwork on there. Get a little bit of a close-up. There you are. Alright. Pull it back up really quick here. Alright. Um, the game does come with the baggies, I know that. So, uh, comes with storage baggies for you. Mm. Big dice. Some meeples. It's a, uh, up to four people can play this game. So it looks like there are the uh, four different player colors here. We have green, purple, orange, and black. Let me get one of those out for you to see what they look like. My apologies for the burn on my finger here. There we are. These meeples also, which I am not sure if those are, uh, yeah, I'm not sure what they're for, but there's some nice silvery colored meeples. And this big figure, which is uh, some kind of water spirit, I believe. There's that big uh, river um, on the running through the game board. I believe that uh, this figure stands in the water and moves around. Here are some of the various tiles, um, cardboard bits that come in the game. You got some uh, gold here, you got some herbs, and these different sword tokens with uh, rocks on the flip side. <clears throat> here are some of the uh, monster tokens. Let's get a close up of what those look like because I think that monster is pretty cool looking actually. There are uh, a little bit of difference in them. I'm not sure if they're all different. Nope, some of the same. Uh, but it looks like perhaps certain sizes are, uh, or certain, uh, I don't know if that's point values or, or what it is, uh, that's uh, how much it takes to d defeat it, but it looks like, you know, all the 12s are the same, and uh, some of the other ones are the same. I think that's what it takes to defeat it, and that's the uh, amount of victory points you get, or something along those lines. There are these, um, I believe these are basically scenario cards. I got a little band on them here that I'm trying to get off really quick. There we go. Um, let's see, two and three. So like a player aid. Um, two, two, and let's, oh, okay, multilingual again. So that is um, one, two, three. Okay, so like scenario cards. There's six of them. There's there are only like three different of these uh, adventures, I guess, and uh, two different languages. So that's why there are six cards. Um, the cards in the deck of cards look like this on the back. Getting some nice artwork on there. And in the front, just take a few of these here. They look like this. For each turn you'll be drawing some of these cards, placing um, whatever token is indicated on that space on the board, and then you'll be using your um, 
maples to move around the board and, and uh, try and pick up those items or defeat those monsters and gain points to win the game is, I believe, essentially how this game is played. So that is Adventureland from Haba. Thanks for watching. Bye.